Wow. Take a look at this. It looks like my desktop is flying around in space. Take a look at this. The Danish flag. Wow. I must say. Wow. Hey guys. Today I'll show you how to um, do and how to make the 3D cube. So the first thing, uh, open compass config. Now go to desktop and enable this rotate cube and desktop cube. If you go to rotate cube, you can uh, edit the turning time um, marker sensitivity acceleration uh, speed and time now this zoom you should see right here if I take this down to this it's not very pretty right I can move it all the way up and my cube is far far away so I'll leave it at this if you go to bindings rotate cube um, now this is the the things you have to do to uh, enable it so uh, to start the cube press control alt and button one and the button one is uh, this where you press down and move around with your cursor uh, you can uh, change that so like this and uh, if you wanna use your keyboard rotate left control alt and left and I can do it right so pretty cool so you can play around with uh, this and set it to what you like if you go back and into desktop cube <clears throat> we'll have this fold out control alt down okay um, now if we go to appearance first behavior choose the acceleration the speed and the time again if we go to appearance um, you see this cube color if I do like this it's white like there you can change it as you uh, want and um, you have cube caps uh, the top picture on uh, on your cube as you see I'm, I'm uh, having the Danish flag so uh, you uh, press new and find your image and press open close and you have it now you have to enable this uh, you have to press this button to enable it um, now this sky uh, cube or space cube whatever you want to call it uh, you got to enable that too picture for sky cube so I found this uh, picture right here and I will just show you how it looks in my pictures folder now it looks looks like uh, this kind of weird and uh, you can find these wallpapers at uh, wallpaperabyss.com I'll include the link in the doodly doo um, but I, I'll say you have to use uh, this image for the best um, quality if you want to do like me like I'm showing you now so when you choose your picture like this you'll have it like this and that is not that's okay but not especially pretty so you can press this animate sky cube press on that and like I said it looks like my cube or my desktop is flying around in space so this is pretty neat and um, I've just press, uh, enabled this uh, animate sky cube so if you don't want a picture you can choose a color 
Now if you go to transparent cube, you can choose uh, opacity while doing rotation and when not rotating. So uh, when doing rotation you see I have no transparency now. If I change this like half ways, oh, you can pro probably can see it like this, transparent cube. I can see through it. I'll have it like this. Looks much better. But uh, basically, that's all you have to do. Um, start with uh, enabling these two, rotate cube and desktop cube. And basically, all I, all you have to do is play around with it um, until you like what you're seeing. I like this very much. Um, looks amazing. So uh, thank you for watching. Rate, comment, and subscribe. See you in my next video. Bye.